Mixed reaction tonight to a proposal that could bring a 12-story building to an historic Long Island village that prides itself on staying small. CBS 2's Jennifer McLogan with more on the high-rise fight from Roslyn. I would say no to this development. Opinions are flying on Long Island's North Shore. I think it's a great option to bring more housing in. Historic Roslyn settled 1633, where landmark status and preservation are honored, says village trustee Craig Westergaard. We have uh, five historic districts in the, uh, in the community, and the building that we're standing in front of is, is what we're most proud of, which is the grist mill. Across from the grist mill, the venerable clock tower. This landmark could soon be dwarfed if some developers get the okay to build a 12-story high rise right here overlooking Roslyn Creek on Lumber Road. We encourage uh, in the community buildings that are of, of the appropriate scale, buildings that are uh, keeping in character with, with the charm of the, of the community. It's beautiful. That's what this is. This town is for. It's so quaint. Others say with its pristine parks, charming shops, architecturally significant homes, change along the water would be welcomed. Business owner Tom Majeris. You like the development? You like the tall building? Sure, I like, I like this to be like New York, New York City. An attorney representing the school district says there is significant concern over the project's impact. We actually work with the school district and everything. As far as the school buses going, it's going to be crazy. 27 apartments at about $2 million each is the proposal. Lots of green space and innovation. A public hearing is scheduled next month. From Roslyn, Long Island, Jennifer McLogan, CBS2 News. And proponents of the high rise say there would be minimal effect on the Roslyn School District.